Hi guys! I'm back again with another tutorial and today I'm going to show you how to make this beautiful design. It's called mascara and it has been co-designed by two designers Cap5898 on Instagram and also Lumbax also on Instagram. Unfortunately, I can't show you how this bracelet looks in real because I managed to sell it recently, but uh, we can have a look here on the catalog card. We are going to work with two kinds of colors. One color is the one that is in the center of the bracelet. It makes these loops. I also use the blue for these lower loops over here. Those are all blue. And then I use different colors for these ribbons over here, for these uh, little wings. Uh, so this is the color scheme I'm going to show you today. However, you can use whatever color scheme you want, of course. So, we start with the cup band, we pull two bands through, in my case it is two bands of the same color, they are going to be blue. And then the sequence is made by three steps, first in row two we pull this color band through the first loop only. We don't pick up anything, so we have three loops on this side and here in row 3 we cross these bands as uh, indicated here. So we take band 1 and band 2 and pull it over the band 3. And then in row number 4 we just remove the first loop from the hook, let these two loops slide down under the hook and then we put this loop back on the hook. So we will end up only with one uh, loop over here. Then we turn the hook around and repeat steps 2, 3 and 4, 2, 3 and 4 again from the other side. So it is going to be the same. And we will end up with two loops on the hook. So I had to pick up the phone that was ringing and I'm back. So, we will end up with two loops on the hook and those are actually these two that we had in the first, uh, first row. Now we can see that there is a mistake over here because the sequence begins with pulling two uh, bands through the first cap band. So I will have to correct this in the catalog card that will be posted in my uh, catalog. Oh, sorry, this is my kitty again, helping. So, this star should be here, because when we have these two loops over here, we need to pull two bands through it first. Just then we can continue doing the rest. All right, so now let me show how it looks in real. So we will start with the cup band, blue cup band, and I need to pull two blue bands through it, like this. Like this, and I This is the first row. I have four loops on my hook and in the row number two I need to make the first ribbon, which is going to be this purple one. So I take the purple and I need to pull it just through one loop, the first loop, like this. And when this is done, I need to do this uh, crossing and it means the first two loops needs to be pulled over the third one 
it means these two violet purple bands needs to be pulled over the blue one so I will do it one by one like this so blue is the first and these two purple bands are over here and now in the last row I need to remove the first one and let these two loops slide under the hook. So I remove the first one from the hook, but I still hold it between my fingers and I just let these slip down and I rehook the blue, like so. Then I need to go to the other side and repeat steps 2, 3 and 4 again from this side too. So I take another purple, pull it through the first loop and then I need to pull these two purple ones over the blue, like this, you see? And when this is done, I need to remove the blue and let the purple slide down and rehook the blue back on the hook. So I have created these two color loops on the sides that make the ribbon. It will look more like a ribbon after a few more sequences. And here I continue from the beginning because I've ended up with two loops over here so I will continue from here. This star should be here. I will uh, correct it in the catalog. So we continue with row number one. So I take two more bands and pull them through. So I have four loops on my hook again and I need to make another ribbon. Another ribbon will be red. So I take red, I pull it through the first, rehook it and now I need to cross these red loops over the blue one. Then I remove the blue, let the red slide down and rehook the blue like this. And then the same from the other side. I pull the red through the first loop, cross these red loops over the blue remove the blue and let the red slide down and rehook so you can see these little ribbons are already showing maybe the first sequence is a little bit different just because it it's the first but after adjusting the bands it looks the same see so this is uh, how you continue repeating the sequence. Don't forget that you need to start here. The star should be here and you actually repeat everything from the beginning. All four rows as indicated in the card. And I will fix this in the catalog and put it to the correct place over here. Continue doing this until your bracelet is long enough and when it is, it is enough just to put a C-clip over here when you have these two loops on your hook. It means in the very end of the last sequence of yours. And then you just attach the C-clip and the bracelet is ready. So and that's it. So please, don't forget to tag and hashtag the keywords and names if you post your pictures in the internet or on Instagram. 
and I will be very happy if I see you very soon at my next tutorial. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.